Good evening. A Herberton man's been charged with trespass and willful damage following an incident in Mareeba on Saturday night. Police arrested the 54-year-old man after he allegedly threw rocks at the windows of a Barrett Street business around 9pm. And a new resort-style aged care facility is coming to the Tablelands. The 76-lot facility will be built at the intersection of Weaver Street and the Kennedy Highway. Good evening. Townsville locals are being urged to stay away from Idalia Lake. It comes as blue-green algae has been detected in the water. Council says it's monitoring the situation. And there will be plenty of pink and purple around tomorrow for International Women's Day. Townsville residents can help celebrate the women and girls in our community through a number of virtual events. 35 degrees in Townsville tomorrow. I'll see you soon. A number of Sunshine Coast families are now eligible for childcare subsidies. From today, families with two or more children aged under five will benefit from savings of up to $2,200 each year. And in Rugby Union, the Fijian Drewers secured their first Super Rugby Pacific win on the Sunshine Coast. The team defeated the Melbourne Rebels 31-26 at Sunshine Coast Stadium on Friday night. Hello again. A number of central Queensland families are now eligible for childcare subsidies. From today, families with two or more children aged under five will benefit from savings of up to $2,200 each year. Meanwhile, tomorrow is International Women's Day and we're being encouraged to celebrate the achievements of females and girls. Locally, a dinner will be held at Gladstone Convention Centre to mark the occasion. Hello again. A person was rushed to Bundaberg Hospital this morning following a two-vehicle crash at Sharon. They were in a stable condition when transported from Jinjin and Davis Roads shortly after 10 o'clock. Meanwhile, One Mile and St Helens schools were shut again today due to the ongoing flood damage. Students from the Wide Bay schools are continuing external learning as a result. 33 degrees in Bundaberg tomorrow. I'll see you soon.